Hey guys, um, welcome to my second um, ever YouTube video. Um, today I'm going to be doing a Q&A because I thought it would be a good idea um, since I'm still quite new on YouTube and it will mean some of you can get to know me a little bit better. Um, yeah, so never done one of these before so let's let's start. Um, also my little sister wants to say a little hello as well before we start. She is, um, how old are you? Seven. She's seven. Um, so my first question is, what is your favourite movie? That's a really difficult one, because um, there's so many amazing movies. I'm a massive sucker for romantic comedies and romantic films. I literally love a good romance. Um, so it would definitely be a rom-com and I've got so many that I love. Um, I also love Disney. I think, oh, I really don't know. Um, I love Friends of Benefits with Mila Kunis. I feel like it's such a good feel-good movie. That is one of my favourites. Um, I'm also a massive fan of High School Musical. Where are you from? Um, I'm from England. I was born in Bristol. I'm, my, my mum is French, so my mum was born in France and moved here when she was about 23, 24. Um, so I am half French. Um, I've also got some Algerian in me as well. My dad is, kind of, is mostly, is all half Irish, half English. So English, Irish, French, Algerian. So next question. Do you speak any other languages? Uh, yeah, so I speak French. Um, I've spoken French since I was little and I speak Spanish as well although my Spanish I've not spoken it since graduating in 2018 so it's a little bit rusty um, I've not been to Spain since and I do really want to start picking it up again so like it's I think learning a new language is great like when you learn a new language you learn no, it's not just a language, you learn a whole other culture. It's a whole way of thinking. So it's really cool to be able to do that. What is your favourite place that you have visited? Oh, I have visited a lot of amazing places. Um, it has to be Mauritius. Um, that Mauritius is an island in the Indian Ocean just off of Africa. Um, I went there during my year abroad because I was actually studying at the university in the Reunion Island which is also just off of Africa in the Indian Ocean and it's only a 25 minute flight to Mauritius so I visited Mauritius at the end of my um, Erasmus and it was amazing literally it was incredible the beaches are insane and it was just amazing I had so many amazing things I saw a volcano erupt one with dolphins in the ocean it was honestly an amazing experience um so I think the reunion of Mauritius are my favorite places but Mauritius um definitely definitely top have any siblings yes I do I have three younger sisters one is seven one is 16 and one is 19 um so quite big age differences and a lot of girls in my family and i love it i think i'm quite girly i'm because i've grown up with so many sisters um um how do you edit your photos um uh, so I edit all my photos just on the Instagram app to be honest um, I just kind of use the settings sometimes I use some filters but I just play around I do a lot to my photos it's more just playing around with lighting and honestly I'm not that great at editing photos I don't put a lot of time into it I see some people's like Instagrams and they're like perfectly curated feeds and I'm like wow I want to do that they look amazing um, or like all their photos are like similar lighting and they all like match and I love it and I think it looks so pretty and I'd love to do that. How often do you work out? Um, I aim to work out three to four times a week which isn't loads um, because life is super busy and I mean aiming for something manageable is important just because someone else is working out five times a week if they've got the time that's great but if you don't don't feel like that's what you should be doing because otherwise it can pressure you into thinking 
you've got to be doing that and then if you're not doing that then you kind of end up thinking what's the point and then you might not go at all like if you've only got time to go once a week that is amazing and that's better than nothing don't compare um two times a week same thing um if i'm having a really busy week i might only hit the gym um two times and that's okay um since the lockdown started i've been working out every day to every other day but they've not been massively intense workouts they've just been like a run and stretch and some yoga or a home body weight workout or a bit of hit so like it's not really intense and my body doesn't need as much recovery time and it kind of doesn't take that long but when I'm going to the gym it takes well, when I've been working it's been taking a bit longer so four times on a good week and then two to three well two on a bad and then three on an average week but I do want to up that um next question indoor or outdoor pool um definitely outdoor as long as it's heated in the winter i love nothing more than an outdoor pool literally in the summer they're amazing and spain and italy and all the cool lovely hot european countries have them in the summer and everyone just goes down to the pool as if it's a beach in england we don't really have many i know in london there are a few um there aren't loads around so um, next question how did you manage life after graduation um so after graduation it was a bit of a weird i went i went straight into a summer job um which was my job as an activity leader for foreign students who come to my town and study so my job was to just do activities keep them entertained go on trips so the summer after my graduation i was just doing that basically um, it was a weird time because I then went on a break with my current boyfriend. Um, so I was going through that, which was a bit complicated. And then as soon as that happened, I booked flights to America and to Thailand. Um, so I did a little bit of traveling. I stayed with a friend in New York City and I also um, spent some time with some friends in Thailand um which was really nice and they were so lovely so that happened and then after i got back i was really because i was still quite down about the breakup i was really motivated to do something different and just like push myself so i just applied for a load of jobs in london and i got a temporary job um in advance for the christmas period because they were super busy and then i got an internship for business development um, which I wasn't massively keen on because I don't like sales um, and then I went into operations since graduating it was very rushed and very I've never had time to think or pause it was just work travel and then back to work it was just because of the whole breakup I just it was just kind of like constant I never stopped and had a minute to think this period now is the first time I've stopped to think and really take everything in since graduating and thinking about what I want to do um, which is really weird because yeah I don't know I never had time to think after graduating it was just break up travel work like everything was just so crazy and hectic um, so I'm really enjoying this period um, um, so next question um, which follows on quite well is um, how are you doing with social distancing um i'm doing really well actually i love it um i'm really enjoying staying at home i've been in london for a long time and i've just really really loved being home for such a long period of time um and being forced to stay in my house i've just been organizing my room which is still a massive like um, job so much to organize in my room because it's literally just chaotic and I've not organized it since graduation I've been doing yoga I've been reflecting I've been working on myself I've been starting learning how to edit videos um, I've been just doing everything I've want to be do be, like things I've just wanted to do but just haven't had time um, and I've started this YouTube which I'm super happy and excited about it's like my own little place of reflection um, and yeah so i've just i really loved it and i'm with my family so i'm not alone 
I think if I was alone, I would find it really difficult. I know a lot of people are, a lot of NHS workers or people who can't go back to their parents because they're elderly. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm really, I'm enjoying the social distancing. Who is your favorite singer? Ooh, that. My favorite singer, not just, well, I love her music. Um, I love their music, both their music. Um, I think it's ta it has to be Taylor Swift and Selena Gomez. They are both such inspiring women. Not only have they got such great music, I find them really inspiring as people. Um, and they are great role models. Um, so yeah, go Taylor Swift and Selena Gomez. Are you having trouble working out consistently? Um, no, not really. Like during like kind of I spoke about earlier during this period I'm at home so I'm not really doing massively intense workouts but I am going for a run here and there like most days I go for a run do some yoga and a, like a hit workout or home workout so it's no I've been working out every day to every other day so it's not been too bad I'm at home all day I'm not working right now so I've not really got any excuses second to last question what is your perfect date um so my perfect day it would be oh that's a really hard one i think my perfect day would be something like either a meal out followed by bowling because i like bowling i think it's so much fun um and it's really interactive and social so you get to know pe the person or if you already know them it's your boyfriend you have a good time with them and my last question of the video do you have a boyfriend um yes i do um he we are doing long distance he's in manchester i'm in bournemouth which is like a four and a half hour train um we've been doing long distance ever since third year of university so that's like been t how many years is that I don't know it's like three or four years we've had to do long distance which and it really really sucks and I hate it usually we see each other maybe like once every three weeks to once a month if I'm if it's a good month maybe every two weeks um and yeah right now because of the whole corona situation we've not seen each other for ages and I'm not sure when I am gonna next see him um but things like video chatting are really great when you're doing long distance date nights like virtual date nights um but yeah that's my boyfriend situation um but yeah so that's the end of my q a thank you so much for watching and i hope this is kind of helps you get to know me a little bit better loving making youtube videos it's been so much fun and i can't wait to keep making some more um i'm gonna do like a mixture of lifestyle fitness fitness tips maybe a little bit on how i how i've been growing my instagram if you'd be interested in that do let me know in the comments um or just let me know whatever you kind of like i'd love to know what you guys would like to see um in the comments literally just comment what you'd want me to film and i will try to my best to do so um but yeah thanks so much for watching um and if you like the video give me a thumbs up and subscribe <laughs>